These are the highlights of our 34th fiscal period. First of all, in terms of external growth, we have acquired two office buildings from our sponsor, Hewa Real Estate. Also, when the 35th fiscal period begins, we will acquire an additional four properties from Hewa Real Estate as a portfolio replacement measure. On the other hand, we are selling the land the Mita Hewa building stands on to Hewa Real Estate in two separate transactions in the 34th and 35th fiscal periods. As for internal growth, even though the fiscal period under review is not a prime time for residential business, we achieved a new record for second half performance in a non-busy season due to an extremely high occupancy rate. With our office business providing stable performance in the mid 99th percentile as well, we achieved our highest combined office and residential portfolio average occupancy rate on record in this period. We also achieved a new record in NOI yield. Next, the financial side. We have been reducing our financial costs for 16 consecutive fiscal periods, and we are also acquiring revenue from the sale of the Mira Hewa building land to Hewa Real Estate. By adding a portion of this revenue to our internal reserves, our internal reserves were increased to 4.49 billion yen at the end of the fiscal period. Also, our NAV per unit was 121,472 yen at the end of the 34th fiscal period, an ongoing increase for the ninth consecutive fiscal period. The following are our financial results. In terms of operating revenue, although we had significant revenue from the sale of Hirokoji Aqua Place in Nagoya conducted in the previous fiscal period, this transaction has been completed. On the other hand, due to gain on sale of the Mita Hewa building land mentioned earlier and the extremely high occupancy rate of our office business especially, overall earnings are increased in this fiscal period. However, due to the major reduction in revenue from sales compared to the previous fiscal period, operating revenue has decreased. Our net income is 2,487 million yen, of which 143 million yen is being added to our internal reserves. We have also been conducting so-called negative goodwill initiatives since the 29th fiscal period, and although we are eliminating the reserve for temporary difference adjustment each period, this involves the continual removal of 40 million yen, and the distribution payments, including this amount for the current fiscal period, will be increased to 2,350 yen, 50 yen above the payments for the previous fiscal period. This is the current assumed ordinary distribution. Our current expectation is an actual distribution payment ranging from 2,378 to 2,455 yen. We will continue steady implementation, and the remainder depends on external growth factors. Although we will refrain from overextending ourselves, I hope to achieve a 2,500 yen distribution payment by the 38th fiscal period while continuing to proactively add high-quality properties to our stock.